Good morning, Rosie. So, um, the mood if it is of uncertainty. There is 40% of voters that are still are undecided, so it's very hard to predict what is going to happen. Today is the last day of electoral campaign, so all political parties are uh, trying to convince these undecided voters. Um, tomorrow is what we call the day of reflection, the silence day, so it's forbidden to um, to have any political uh, activity, any political rally for voters to decide where they are going to vote. But we will, what we will know for sure is that the parliament is going to be very fragmented. Uh, what we know for the latest polls is going to be very fragmented. So is the end of a B-party system that we have known until now. Until now. And um, so, um, for the first time in history, we are having five candidates running for presidency. So the Socialist Party, the Conservative Party, Popular Party, uh, Ciudadanos, the Citizens Party, uh, and also Podemos, the Left Party, and Vox. So, uh, as I say, it's going to be very fragmented parliament. For sure, they are going to need to forge uh, coalitions to give stability to the country. And let's see what happens on Sunday after this last day today of uh, campaign. Uh, you mentioned there Vox, the far right party, who in previous elections have been absolutely, you know, invisible, really. What kind of impact are they going to have on Sunday, do you think? Well, actually, the fact that they were not in the televised uh, debates is giving them a lot of visibility because they presented themselves as the victims of, of uh, the system they reject. Of course, they've been uh, doing a very aggressive uh, campaign uh, regarding immigration, regarding women, and especially on the national issue of uh, Catalonia. As you know, uh, in their program, they want to suppress the autonomy of uh, Catalonia. They want to, uh, in a Trump style, to build a wall in Ceuta and Melilla. So they have been very, very aggressive. And um, maybe it's not so much that the, the latest polls give them 30 seats in the parliament. Uh, but maybe it's not so much them in itself, but also the popular party, the conservative party and the liberal party, Ciudadanos, uh, dragged themselves also to the right, following very much their agenda and their rhetoric. So uh, we could see what actually what happened in Andalusia, that uh, the popular party and the citizens party might uh, make a coalition with Vox. So, this is um, this is very much the the risk actually.